Hello, and welcome back to Draw Toys, the podcast video series where we try and draw different things uh, for various different themes. And today we've got a new theme, so those of you watching will already know the theme in the description. But my three guests today don't actually know what the theme is going to be. <laughs> so as always, I am joined by Dan. Hello. Tim. Hello. And Tom. How's that going? And... As with the usual draw toys kind of thing, I have a folder in front of me with 10 different images. Uh, however, I don't know which one to pull. So I'm going to need somebody's help to choose a number between 1 and 10. Could could That's somebody... Maybe, uh, maybe uh, but I don't think she's here. So would one of you like to choose a number between 1 and 10, please? I'm going to say three. Three. Right. Okay. So I'm going to post number three. Then I'll explain the theme to everybody. Uh, at home, I'll try and pop it up on screen. Same time. So this is our image number one. So if everyone can see that, I presume. Right. Yes. Okay. So our theme today is video game box arts. So, I'm kind of following a theme I saw online from a couple of different artists, which was redrawing a box art in their own style. And I thought, well, funny you should mention that, because all of us <laughs> uh, lack style. None, none of us have any. But still, I thought it would be fun to try and recreate a box art. So, as I've discussed with the gentleman before this episode, we're streamlining it a little bit, just because box art are a little bit more involved. So I think 30 seconds is just going to be, it's pointless. No one's going to make anything even remotely like a box art so we're going to have three minutes to draw it and then 12 minutes to draw it so i think three minutes is enough that we'll get the vague kind of like you know image down and then 12 minutes should be enough to at least draw the box art in our own style so um without further ado if everybody's ready we're going to go off and draw the box art for pokemon blue version my body is ready all right mind is ready I'll see you all in three minutes. All right, so we are back. Uh, we've drawn both our three-minute version and our 15-minute version. Now, I said 12 before the break, uh, but we kind of all agreed that 12 was a little bit a little bit tight. So we, we, we did 15 just because it gives us that you know extra time to... To brush up and make it look, I'd say, identical to the box art. Uh, I think everyone everyone came away with that, I'm sure. Uh, uh, right, so first we're going to post our three-minute ones. And Tom has volunteered this time to go first. So, Tom, if you'd like to post your three-minute version of Pokemon Blue version uh, in the chat, I will have on screen both... The box art and Tom's version, just to be able to tell uh, the difference. I'm finding it difficult. I, I'm glad you posted that one. Hmm. He, he, looks, uh, he looks like a goblin. <laughs> it, oh, he looks a little bit to me like... Um, I, don't, I, don't, I, I'm, I can't... Uh, he looks familiar, but I don't know where his face looks familiar from. Like a troll or something. Yeah, yeah, maybe from like a kid's no like, troll. like he looks like a mutated version of Okie Doke, but <laughs> it's not quite. I don't know. I I've seen goblins from somewhere else that it's giving me vibes of, but I don't know. Anyway, uh, it looks like a long like he hasn't. You know, the this goblin hasn't got enough hair either. It's mm. like his like rec receding hairline, but it's like still going. I will, I will say though, Tom, you have got the pause in abstract down, like sort of. Mm. <laughs> sort I mean, if of it. if if I saw this, if someone showed, I I would be like, oh, oh, is that you know, sort of like I I can I can see the pause, not not perfectly, but you know, I am proud of you, Tom. Uh, would anyone like to go next, or I'll go next? It's, it's up to you guys. Um, I'll go next. Sure, why okay. not? Okay. Sure, I'll go last then, in this case. I'll, I'll invert the roles. Dan, you go next. Oh, oh, okay. okay. Damn. Wait, like a... For three minutes, Dan, that is like... 
That's that's very good. Like, I, you know, obviously there's no colour and stuff, but, like, in terms of, like, line art, I can easily see what you're going for. That yeah, is, like... You're like, you've, like, obviously you've run out of time and not been able to do the rest yeah. of the shell and stuff, but, like, you've got the top off, all right, yeah. Mm. Okay. Yeah, honestly, his his head, his shell, the cannon placement, his arms, everything is, like, correct. You know, it sort of... No. Oh, I've realized which one Tom Tom's reminds me of the original concept art for Shrek. <laughs> oh my god! Yes! Oh. Ooh! Yeah. That's I... that's what I'm getting. But if he was blue and had a big shell. Hmm. I I like it, Tom. I, I think And that was an intentional callback Tom hid in his art because oh, yes. that's his style. Uh Tim, <laughs> would you like to post yours? I would like to post mine. And I would like to see your post. Oh! Oh, wow! Yeah. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> Blue. The thing I'm not happy about is his little um, the cannon just looks like he's got a hole in him. <laughs> also, yeah. also, it's I don't. Insect. I don't mean to nitpick. <laughs> I don't want to nitpick. He does have five legs. <laughs> okay, what did I turn into two? And I kind of didn't realize what happened. It kind of looks like an AI generated. Yeah. <laughs> it's, uh, hey, uh, hey, Dally, make me a child's drawing of Blastoise. Uh, <laughs> I like it though. It, it looks a bit Ivy esque almost. Kind of like. <laughs> I'm not sure. Like the snail shell. Yeah. Yeah, he's a snail now. Um, right, I will post mine then. As you can tell, I ran out of time to colour in and stuff. Uh, so he's a very Ooh. basic. He's a very he's basic. Like very top heavy. Very like, yes. uh, I've got all my muscles up top, and I reckon underneath what you can't see, he's got tiny little legs. It's like, like a hen. Yeah, go on. Mr. Incredible or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. He, Mr. Incredible body shape. He's a, he's like a, a Dorito. Yeah, hench. kind of. Yeah. Yeah. He's also oh, um... he kind of he could be like a heart shape, like he's just full oh. of like... oh, well, you know those droids in Star Wars. In, oh, the uh... super battle droids. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. He got a bit of it's... a super battle droid vibe. It's one of those cosplaying a Blastoise at the droid party. <laughs> well, that that's that's lovely. We have made some beautiful art. Now, I think the addition of. 12 more minutes can only mean that it's going to look beautiful. Uh, yeah. Ken Sugimori, I imagine, uh, you know, would would be proud. So, Tom, do you want to... It was you first. One. Uh, yeah. Yes. Would you like yeah. to pit, post your 15-minute one? Here it goes. Oh, okay. Mm, okay. I, I quite like that. That's like... I think, I think that's really good. And... Yeah. Yeah, the, the colour. make him look kind of menacing. Yeah. You've got the colour down really well as well. I wanted uh, to do yeah. the shade, in, but I just couldn't. I was having yeah. trouble. There. You've also got the little, um, the little notch in his in his uh, cannon. So kudos yeah. to that, because I was looking at that and it's like, oh god, I'm not going to have time to do this detail on his cannon. But yeah, I quite like that. It's kind yeah. of, um, it reminds me of kind of you know you'd see, like. Other artists drawing some other like character, like you know, this manga artist drew Spider Man, but drew him in like an exaggerated, hyper, you know, kind of mm. yeah. thing. It's giving me that kind of vibe. I, I like it. He, he's the only problem with it. It's like it's being stretched to the side. Like it's yeah, wired, he, he wired. <laughs> to be fair, he, he yeah, is a what probably, criticism. Small what's criticism, funny yeah. is I could probably go on paint and make it thinner. Just by morphing it, and it might look fine actually. To be fair, I found drawing the art of the like artwork, he's a very wide boy. Like, Mm. it doesn't help, I think, that it's drawn kind of from an above angle, which so looking down, he's gonna look squatter and wider than he is. Mm. But yeah, I really like that. Well done, Tom. Uh, Dan, would you like to go next? Oh, yes. Uh, let me bring it up. Oh, okay, okay. This I like that. Makes it look like an album cover. <laughs> <laughs> it does. Oh, wait, um, dude, is that that album Pokemon by Game Boy? 
Nintendo. I quite like that. That that's got. I mean, that that I am glad to see there is working out because when I saw all the posts of like, oh, these really good artists, like do it in your your style, I was like, oh god, is it all? Really good artists for DM. Yeah, Yeah. no, of course, but I was just concerned that maybe it would all look the same. But so far, absolutely not. I really like that, Dan. That's again, you've got the colours down pat, and uh, yeah, you sort of you and. Yeah, I, I like that you've done the borders and stuff. I'm very, very proud of you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, Tim, do you want to post your one? Do a thing. Ooh, okay. Ooh, oh, so we, we, we've we had two mad lads who have gone for the borders then. Good Lord. I, I think I, I quite... put too much time into the board. I didn't put enough time into his shell. He looks like he just got a big poop on him. He looks a little yeah. bit like um crustal. Kind of like <laughs> yeah. or um He's gonna use shells, No, um Knackley. Knackley's head, you know, his like the, the brown top that looks a bit like a mushroom kind of thing. Yeah, yeah, he's actually he's shellless, he's a shellless blastoid standing in front of a knackley. Oh yeah. It looks a little bit um paintbrush drawn, kind of. It gives me that vibe mm. that you know, sort of This is paintbrush. Drawn. I scanned it of in course. real quick. Yeah, yeah. If you got out your oil sets, uh, you know, yeah. get ready. That's very nice. I yeah. like it. Yeah, it is. People would pay for that. I mean, I they better. If, if anyone yeah. watching Draw Toys <laughs> would like to pay me for a copy of Pokemon Blue, then I'm willing to have that discussion. He will he will mail it to you on the second finest printer paper that he can find. <laughs> I'll mail it to you on whatever papers in the office in the printer. <laughs> in the printer in the office? That's the one. Yeah. I like it. It's, uh... Yeah. Mm. Right. I'm going to post mine. Uh, who is very squat. I... I can't Ooh, that's really good. Cool. He's, he's, he's all right. I, I, I had to redraw, like, half of him because he was way too wide. <laughs> but... Yeah, but uh, th- thankfully for the extra three minutes that Tom suggested, I was like, okay, I can actually colour him properly as opposed yeah, to just like... the shading's really nice and you've got like a shadow of his arm and, mm. uh, on his, which I really like as well. I like yeah. the way that every single one of us has put specific effort into making sure he's got that little tooth on the side. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, you got like, it. the only thing every single one has in common. Exactly. Except, yeah. That's what I mean, makes Blastoise Blastoise. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not his canon. No. But, uh, nope. No, no, no. It's it, that one little tough. It's that cute. Um, what's it? Uh, you know the, the the fang Tom with anime girls. Yeah, the, yeah. So sort of like yeah, the, yeah. they've all got the fang. Uh, you know. Yeah. Nice well, anime girl trait. Exactly. Well, I I'm really proud of us. I think they are genuinely all different themes. Uh, you know, like styles. Uh, uh, yeah, I, I'm really genuinely happy this turned out quite well. Happy, in fact, so much that I think we'll do another one. Uh, Nanny. That's what we do Nanny. in every episode of Draw Toys, so it's not really a uh, right. So, one of these has been eliminated, so we're down to just nine. Now, Tim chose last time, uh. Who would like to choose a number? Uh, decide between you, and then we'll get on to the number me, thing. Me, 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 me. Okay. You, okay, Dan has said Dan. enough. No. Uh, yeah, Tom, choose a number between one and nine. Nine. Okay. Uh, oh, okay, cool. So, I um, I didn't really mention, but I've got... I have a range of art styles. Some of them are fairly simple. Some of them are very in-depth and stuff. So, I'm going to post... Number nine, no. Oh. Oh. Which I think is it was the simplest artwork I could think of off the top of my head. There's there's probably like Atari games that I could have gone for, I suppose. But uh, so we have Kirby's Adventure from the NES, uh, which you know, look at that cute little little round boy absorbing oh. all the stuff. There's something about there's something sinister about Kirby. You know. Well, I guess so. Um, anyway, on. 
on that topic, let's go off and draw him. Uh, so, we're going to go off now. We're going to have three minutes and 15 minutes to draw Kirby's Adventure from the NES. And we'll be back with our final uh, things in a bit. So, see you soon. All right, we are back. So, we've just spent three minutes and then 15 minutes trying to recreate Kirby's Adventure for the NES. Uh, so, as with last time, uh, Tom has volunteered to go first. So, Tom, would you like to show us your three-minute uh, attempt at Kirby's Adventure? Yeah, here we go. Oh, wow. that's really that's cute. So cute. Yeah. Mm. Oh, it, it, look, <laughs> it looks a little bit like he's uh, swallowed a gerbil or a hamster. <laughs> 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 what hamster? You know, that's big and blue. Well, it's more like, uh, so, sorry, as in, so Kirby's swallowed a hamster and started to look like a hamster, and then is inhaling. Sorry, not the, not the blue part. It's like his because his hands look a little bit like yours, and the eyes are so close together, and the whiskers. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah I can see that. Anyway, yeah, sorry. Uh, I I think that's very cute, though, Tom. I would I would be able to identify that as uh, Blastoise, was it? You do? Uh, Blastoise, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, right. So I think Dan was next. If you, yeah. Dan, do you like to? Yeah, it's really good. Ooh, okay, oh, okay. Wow. So you like it's went a bit from... avant-garde. Yeah, mm. I quite like it. It's a bit fractal. It's kind of like it's very angular. You know, uh, apart from Kirby, obviously, it's it's difficult mm. to draw an angular Kirby. Uh, you know, I really like that though. Well done, Dan. Yeah. I think I yeah. uh, kudos to you doing all of the little background details as well. Like, you know. Yeah. Oh, thank you, thank you. Uh, oh. Tim, would you like to go next? You know what? Yeah. Um, mm. I'm not so. particularly proud of this. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Honestly, though, Kirby's still cute. Like, but he looks soulless. He looks like he hasn't got a soul. Uh, it's well, like he's got a dummy, it's like a baby dummy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. It it looks um, like Babby Kirby. You know, sort of Bobby this is. Kirby. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, not really sure what's going on, but you know, happy to be. Happy, happy to, be... to be involved. Yeah, exactly. All uh, right, I will post my three-minute version. Uh, which is it's it's fine. Yeah. Oh, mm. yeah. It's cute. Very, very, it's very minimalist. Mm. Yes. Very, very porky arms. Uh, yeah. You know, but yeah, it, it it vaguely gets the job done. He is in he's in the void. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right. Well, that those were of great quality, but I reckon we can all do better if we were given enough time and. Lord knows we know. were. Uh, so, Tom, uh, you can only improve from your previous one. Mm, so, okay. we'll see. Uh, let's see what fifteen minutes got, Tom. Oh, oh, mm. wow! Good lord, wow! That's that's very. <laughs> the text is taking me out a little bit, but I love the drawing. <laughs> the like, fucking white gaps in the background. Yeah, sorry. I, I, <laughs> wrong, I did it the wrong way around. Um, that and like halfway through, I, w I was just having so, many so much trouble drawing Kirby for some stupid reason. Like the first time mm. I got it, the second time I was like, I just can't get the shape. Yeah, and the proportions are like were really hard to do. Like it is, it is a little bit. Yeah, sort of. It, it looks very simple, but sort of, it, it is deceptive. Oh, it is deceptive. But, but I, I like the art, though. You've definitely gone gone into, you know, all that stuff. Fair play, Tom. <laughs> gone into all that stuff. All that stuff. All the details. All, all, all the stuff, stuff, you know. I, I, I like the little stars and stuff you focused on as well. That's really cute. Okay. Um, Dan, it's your turn, I believe. Okay. Ooh, ah, That's wow. Really that is really now, good, Dan. I don't know what's giving me this sense, but it feels like you gave up at a certain point. <laughs> what? What do you mean? This looks completely finished. 
this this is the part in the game I think that uh, Kirby escapes the uh, the void. <laughs> The void of abstract yeah. tubes. Uh, that's really <laughs> cute, though. Honestly, you've you've got Kirby really well there, Dan. That is like adorable. Yeah. He's a cute little guy. Yeah, very well done. And I like oh. the top half of the background. <laughs> <laughs> I like the bottom. It's my favorite part. Okay, well there you go. I was, that was the the like t- like the end called towards the end. I was like, oh shit! I've... Oh really? Yeah. Oh, I think I started with that and then work from there. Yeah. Also, I like you got the peel, the kind of like in the top right. Yes, the peel yeah. is is actually genuinely very very well done. Yeah, okay. I um I completely forgot about that when drawing it, and when I saw yours, I was like, oh shit. Okay. Very nice. Very well done, Dan. Mm, thank you. Uh, Tim, would you like to draw yours? No, draw yours. Draw <laughs> would you yours like to post it? Off. You're 12 minutes going on. Okay. Um, <laughs> see if you can tell where all of my effort went. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is oh. fantastic. It's uh... That's right. All my time went on the palm tree. Kirby does look a little bit like he's firing his laser. That's, that, that's a genuinely good uh, yeah. rendition yeah. of the logo. For a second, I was like, did you just copy and paste it? And sort of like... Uh, no. Well done. That That is... Yeah. yeah. And also, that's, that's, the, that's my... One, you can play as Kirby and the, and the Dark Team, and then there's a final one where you play as all of them together. It's, it's very exciting. Ooh. I, I would play that ROM hack. For sure. For sure. Uh, right, I will post mine then. Uh, who kind of proportionally doesn't look the best, and I ran oh, it. Oh, I design. like it. Oh. No, I like it. looks... Something about the colours really pop. I think it's because mm. the it looks, is in. To me, hmm. like the cover of a comic book. Yeah. Mm, kind of, yeah. yeah. I, I sadly ran out of time. I couldn't draw the, the trees or the sea. But, uh... but you did do a little brown line. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> that, so I was That's going true. to, because I knew I had like 30 seconds left, I was going to just uh, paint paint can the bottom into dark blue. Uh, but it didn't work. So I had to revert it. But Kirby just got a really cool stick. <laughs> exactly, yeah. Oh, well, it all by him somewhere. Well, it looks a little bit like he's fledgling, sort of like he's leaving the nest for the first time. Yeah, yeah. Uh, he's yeah. just yeah. topped yeah. off his branch. <laughs> but he's realised I'm not very good at flying, but I am good at consuming the void. Yeah, exactly. Well, I think that those are some beautiful renditions. That indeed. Yeah, I I had a lot of fun. I think. Um, it's a journey. Yeah, th- this is a good concept for draw toys as well. I think, kind of like trying your best to draw a specific art style, you know, on a particular like picture. It's very good. Yeah, um, it's cool. yeah. No, I I enjoyed it. It's something different as well, and um, and yeah. I, I think everyone would agree that it did it did pan out in a nice way that everyone's own style did kind of come through. You know. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Uh, it looks. Yeah, everyone can tell, especially from the 15 minute ones, you know, you can tell what box art you're going for, but everything looks, you know, quite different. Uh, and on that topic, we'll be doing Draw Toys again in the future at some point, maybe. So, there's a potential. Maybe yeah, mm. um, I'd, I'd like to revisit the drawing Pokemon from memory. That's always fun, I think. Um... Yeah, and we'll just we we'll see what takes our fancy. And I I mean I've got eight more box arts to do oh, as yes. well. AKA we make them. <laughs> yes, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> right. Well, that about wraps it up. I think. Thank you, gentlemen, for joining me for this journey into the world of art. Until next time. Goodbye. 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 goodbye.